Welcome back everyone, I am about to go start my next DLC, which is going to be General Knox. As I said in the past episode, it's not really a surprise. But uh, I'm going to let the intro play here, it should play, and be quiet. Pandora, a planet that once knew only peace and prosperity under the fair and noble direction of the Atlas Corporation. But there were those that sought to disrupt our perfect existence. Thieves and murderers, perverts and scoundrels. The lawless garbage unleashed an unspeakable evil upon Pandora, not known since the Age of the Gods. But together, we shall not despair. Atlas has not forgotten you. We are returning and will restore order and security to your planet. When we arrive... Bullshit. I have choked on the disingenuous lies forged by their corporate greed my entire life. And it is a meal I will no longer stomach. Atlas is here for two things. Power and revenge. And the order they do it in is irrelevant. We share a common enemy, you and I. The reward for your death is second only to mine. That alone should be reason for you to join my cause. But if it is not, and your greed precedes you, then you will gain access to all of their weapons. Their invasion stockpile will be yours. Athena out. We must speak immediately, but I'm afraid for my own security, and therefore you must jump through a hoop or two. Talk to the mechanic. He knows where to find me. And a word of caution, don't touch him if you ever want to eat with your hands again. Alright, so, before I get into this, there's going to be a lot of lance, and they do not like corrosion. So, change this back to corrosive. Uh, shotgun. Wait, isn't this hammer better? Yeah, it is. <laughs> Just a little bit. Alright, so I can get rid of that one. <clears throat> They're weak to corrosive, so I might actually replace my Hellfire. Although, hitting them with the corrosive from my phase lock and the fire dot along with the shock dot might be a pretty good combo. I don't know, I don't think they resist fire. 50? Oh boy. This all better not be level 50. I'm gonna fucking rage if it is. <clears throat> what level is this mission? God damn it. If this doesn't scale... That'd be fucking stupid. I thought it would at least scale up to like 60 or something. I'm gonna need details though. I act all casual like when I say this. It'll at least make the driving code, easier. So I hope you have the mental capacity to follow. Your lady friend told me to send you to Moxie's place when you stop by. Huh, if you know what I'm saying. Hey, you ain't getting nowhere without wheels, boy. And maybe girl. I've been cooking up something new, but I ain't finished the booster system yet. Need a bit of secret sauce if you're willing to lend a hand. Alright, so I gotta go get his parts. Alright, hey, what I'm gonna need is an X372 supercharger, but not the 373. There's recall on that thing, and I'm tired of people here. burning live and shit. Also, a big old tank of nitrous and one of them fancy exhaust booger things. I don't even know what it does, man. Alright, let me see where I am. Get across there. That's just the elevator sounds. Well, traveler, there are new missions available on the T Bone Junction Bounty Board. 
So I'm definitely not going to take any side quests until I uh, beat this then and level it up. Looks like all of this is level 50. Which is really stupid. But there's some chest or something around here. Yep, there is. Yep. Oh, this is irritating. That's not where I'm going. Well, so I'll burn through the story mode on this, and then uh, I think it levels up after that, hopefully. So I won't do any side quests. Um, I know I'm just annoyed at this, but in general, I'm, I'm not the biggest fan of this DLC. Like, a lot of people that kind of... Treat it like, uh, you know, the greatest thing ever. To me, it was just... I don't know. It, it was just so artificially inflated size-wise. Because, uh, all the driving. There will be five teams assembled to guarantee the objective is successful. That was the first. The Omegas are relentless and highly trained. The Elites, Elite. The only advantage you have is that their top operative recently... left their employ. Stay alert. Athena out. Um... Yeah, like, the story is great, but... driving in, the, in these games is terrible, so... Um... Yeah. So all the driving are forced into this to make this DLC, you know, bigger than it really is. So if you take the driving out of this game, it's not even really any bigger than Hammerlocks. And people really bitch at Hammerlocks for being too small, but this whole thing is just driving. It's a lot of freaking driving. Uh, I'm not even going to go to that vendor. I think I can go down this elevator, right? on your secret lady friend. Now, I didn't tell him nothing, but I can't install anything right now. Uh, give me a hand getting the stuff in. Hello, Marcos here. I've got an opportunity for you. Come no, Marcus. My place in T -bon I'll come see you after I level this DLC up. The dumb thing is, like, the, the zombie one was leveled up with me. But then this one is at 50? I just don't get that. People complain about the pre-sequel being buggy, but like, this is a bug that's game-breaking. Alright, so... Yeah, probably gonna be a salt filled episode because of this. Atlas believes in customer service above all else, though all sales are vital. Am I going this way? I take it. Hopefully, my vehicle's at least at my level. Just a heads up that those Crimson D bags set up some roadblocks in the highway. Just get your murder on, and we'll pretend nobody saw nothing. I was actually looking forward to... Because this, once you get out of the cars, has good combat. Uh, 
Ah, shit, no boost. That's enough. Did I go past it? Where do I need to go up at? Why am I fucking around? I'm just gonna dual anarchy all these fuckers. And the good news is I don't have to bother checking any loot. Because there's no loot worth checking. Closer car station up here. Yep. Wait a second. That's good. No, He's not even talking. This is General Knox. I don't uh, really want to be here. This planet smells like hemorrhoids. I sent steel to this planet to take care of this little problem, and also because I seriously have you heard her? She talks all the time. And hello, if you met our friend the sun. So I guess thanks for turning her into a meat kebab. <laughs> also I'm gonna kill you stop Alright, so Okay, so that should be the main one. So I gotta go back to... No, I do go forward. I was thinking Moxie was back in town there, but that was Marcus's, not Moxie's. Seriously? So are my cars not leveled up? There's no way if I'm uh Yeah, so it looks like my car is the same level as theirs. Which is extra stupid, so I do have to still deal with the stupid car combat that's boring as fuck. But uh, the regular combat that's good, I don't get to enjoy. Awesome. Alright, let's see where I'm going in here. That sounds familiar. That's so dumb that my cars aren't my level. I 
just a quick note about Moxie in the event you ain't met her. She got a peculiar streak in her. Loves the limelight, but she ain't as sketchy as she appears to be on stage. Uh, I almost forgot. She's my mom. So you treat her right, or I'll bury you where I buried Lucky. Yeah, I killed him. Don't act all surprised. As I told you, I was gonna do it. Should be through this camp. Do I just drive? No, I'm gonna do this on foot. I don't know why I'm gonna do it on foot. Actually, I should have just drove up there. I need to go get my car. That's weird. Abandoned vehicle. Remember this DLC really kind of screwing up the uh, what are the, the scaling for the entire game, but I didn't know it did this. It's shit level. You need me again? Excuse the mess, but a good kidnapping is never clean. Shank busted in and took Miss Athena for a little ride. You should have seen the fight she put up. That kitty has claws. Mr. Shank is after the chunk of change that Atlas has put on Athena's pretty little face. If you want him, you'll need to do some fancy driving. Luckily, I'm just the person to help with that. Are you ready to rescue the princess? I think you can handle it. I'll be in touch when you get closer. And heading back. Hey there! Mama said you'll be needing the racer for one of your, uh... Um... Adventures! I've up I the just... The truck to the catch a ride system! You should be able to grab one whenever you want. Hey, I'd be careful, though, compared to the monster that... Isn't there a car? Yep. ...the with wheels. Hey, let's get you rolling, man. Let's get out of here. Alright, back to uh, driving to break more roadblocks with my level 50 car.
tempted just to go into a uh, willow tree or something and cheat this till the story mission and just get to uh, where it's leveled up. I don't know if that's possible or not. I think this is where I'm going, right? Yep. Man, I wish I had an afterburner relic right now. I would kill for that. This thing is so slow. Might as well wait till my boost is all the way back. Yeah, it's this kind of stuff, it's just... There's nothing enjoyable about this to me, it's just boring. Did they have to make the roads this long? This doesn't really equate to size to me. I mean, Nox is awesome, Athena is awesome, the story of this was really cool. But unfortunately, like, the gameplay of it is not. <laughs> well, traveler. Yeah, yeah, Claptrap. On the t Junction Bounty Board. Now, why am I risking my neck for you? First off, I think you're cute. Second, Oh, thanks, Moxie. Pandora has put a real pinch on my business. When you guys started rallying things up on this rock, more people came through my joint in a night than booze went through my second husband's liver. Now, the land's control of the highway is shutting me down in a hurry. That's where you and your chica come in. You get straight ahead on this one. Midgetville. Well, traveler. Oh, Jesus Christ. There are new missions available. How often are you going to tell me? Bounty board. Where is... Oh, there's the stairs. Across here? Nope. Oh, maybe I did. Oh, 
all the assassins are here. Oh, duh, it's not done. And there's my car. I think the races are faster. Something I had my Scooby Kittens whip up for me. Got the extra junk in her trunk you'll need to storm the castle. Yeah, this is so much better. Yep, no longer touching that other vehicle. The Atlas Corporation would like to ask for your cooperation in this drone's attempt to kill you. Partnership for tomorrow, today. Alright, so we're... okay. Extra. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I'm supposed to go down there, I think. Alright, I'll deal with these guys. Where was it back there? Did I miss it? No, it's still ahead of me. Yeah, okay, this looks familiar. Yeah, I don't care about you flying guys. You don't scare me. See, normally those devastators are fun. Oh, I'm almost there. Son of a bitch. God damn it. <sighs> That's extra annoying. I gotta run all the way back through here. And it's my own fuck up, but it's super annoying.
Just doing that to get phase walk back faster. And this time I will spawn a new car. Extra delayed killed. Okay, let's not make the same mistake. Good. Oh, this car is so much better. Try to uh, get a kill. What the hell? Here we go. Normally, these areas are a lot of fun. They got XP. Didn't expect that. God, this car is better. The other sad thing about this, when I get to the armory the first time, the entire thing's going to be pointless. guys. I think this is the right way. Yeah, I can go this way. Oh, don't I have to like, hit a jump to go through one of those, or is that a side quest? Oh, crop down. Prison entered. I think that is this. Do I do it by getting up here? I'll find out. Should be able to see the prison now. It used to be an island in the ancient sea. Now it's Mr. Shank's own personal male stabbing machine. That's what she said. High five! Nobody? <clears throat> hmm. You're looking for an outcropping west of the palace. That's going to be your ticket in. Nope, this is where I have to do that jump. Well, might as well fall here. God damn it, come on. Can I get out of here? Yeah. Maybe. 
so I can't drive over the nothing that is there. That's cool. And the nothing that is there. Let's try driving over nothing here. All right. I gotta go around this way. Something like this. I'll drive around and find this again. There it is. Don't aggro cars. Night. Oh, son of a bitch. So close. I hit um, what seems to have been nothing. Which is awesome. I had the speed, the distance, the boost. Oh, I made it. Pretty sure this is where I'm going. Yep. Might as well spend that skill point. You found hubby number one's house. I always thought. Oh shit! I had to jump that. Stump ramp. Time to find out. It's showtime. There's even more reason they need to do a remastered version of this game. It's just... Fix these things like the stupid scaling. Fix the FOV shit. When you get inside the walls, find an echo transmitter so I know you made it. Might as well get out of my car before they blow it up. Echo. <laughs> you made it! I bet those bitches weren't expecting you to land on their heads. Okay, I'm sure Mr. Shank is holding your girl in one of those cell blocks. Get inside the building. I'm gonna wait till they're done talking. Sometimes that glitches out uh, quests. 